cats have woken me up and I don't know if he's dead or not so I'm going to deal with it quickly. It's the first time they've ever bought anything in for me like this. So I thought I'd show you before I have to dispose of it. So uh, this is it. Make a bag us today, aren't you? I wonder why Chloe was crying so much. This is Chloe. And Chloe was crying and that's Coco. Well, here's my baby this morning, which I didn't want, and he is alive. I'm going to have to chuck him over the fence. Otherwise, my cats are going to bring him in again, and it's only 9 o'clock in the morning. So, he is well and truly alive. And I had him in my bedroom this morning. So, he could have gone anywhere. So, I'm holding on with gloves, because I thought he was dead. And I went downstairs to get gloves. The cats were watching him and he didn't even bloody move. So I know he's alive. He's been wriggling. And he opened his eyes. There he is. Well and truly alive. Oops. What a thing to wake up to the morning in the morning. You must thought I wanted breakfast. <laughs> And Chloe, the big one, was crying and crying. She brought it in. I think this is a... Oh, I'm not sure what it's called now. Baby water wrap, because we've had them before. Many years ago in the house. And my other cat called, I used to play with them. But never, you know, kill them. So this one is alive. Only frightened to death because the cats have been at it. Uh, I didn't want it this morning. Good job I uh, got up to have a look. There you are. Gonna chuck him over the uh, fence now by the brook because he'll go there. Because if I chuck him anywhere in the garden, the cats will just bring him back in. And I don't want him in the house. So I'm gonna have to keep an eye on her now. She's gonna start doing this rubbish for me. So I just thought I'd show you. They don't run away, because I've had them for years in the house before. So I'm holding him securely by the tail. And when they do run, they're quite fast little buggers. But this one is a little baby. And uh, he's not going anywhere. So I'm going to put him back in the stream where he belongs. And hopefully they won't come back into the garden. Right, come on then. He's not moving because I've got him securely by the tail, but he is alive. Because I saw him move. He's probably just a bit frightened, actually. So. I'm going to put this down now.